In this video, I will be doing a spooky edit. As you all know, it's October, and we have to do a Halloween edit. And if you want to practice this, then check the link in description to download the stock images I used. And yeah, don't forget to like and comment on the video. So with that all been said, let's move on to the editing. Here we are in Ibis Paint X. I recorded in horizontal view, and I hope you guys are okay with this. Comment down if you liked it or not. Okay, so let's first add in our pumpkin head into the canvas. Now we need a background for him to sit on. So let's add this one in and place him like this. Okay, so actually we only need the foreground. So I'm gonna erase the background like this. Now let's add in this image and I'm gonna cut out the branches really quick. Okay, that took a lot. Now let's add everything in place and see how it looks. Perfect. Now let's add some bushes. One here like this, and I'm gonna duplicate it and flip it on the other side. Now let's make the foreground darker. We don't actually need this much of light. And do the same for the bushes. Now let's paint in some shadows for the bushes and pumpkin. This looks a bit awkward, so I'm gonna erase it. Now bit more shadows on the bushes because to show that it's actually closer to the pumpkin. Now we need a sky. So let's add in this beautiful sky image. Don't it look beautiful now? I'm gonna make the tree darker. Okay, so as you guys can see, we don't need these highlights on the side. So I'm gonna paint in some black in there. Now let's make some glows. One here, another one here. Now for the mouth. Okay, now he looks evil as hell. Now since Ida glowing, we need to paint those lights on the foreground. So let's do that. How about we add these grass on the front so we can give it some depth? I made the darker. And adding more and made the darker. And this time, I made them blur and repeat the same few times. We can't forget about the highlights, can we? By the way, if you don't know how to paint highlights, I have done a tutorial link in description. Now I was thinking, let's duplicate it and flip it like this. Wow, that's way better. Okay, we don't need it to be this much bright on this area, so let's paint in some shadows. And we need highlights too on the other side. Add in some pumpkin vine. This is pretty 
basic like make it darker and paint some shadows on this side. And also, I'm gonna give it some drop shadow. Now let's add in some tree twigs, one on this side. Then I'm gonna make it darker and also give it a blur effect and add few more in the back. Now, I was wondering how would it look if I add this spider web on those trees? I'm gonna use the perspective form and change its perspective a bit. Now change its blending mode to screen, and there you have it. Isn't that sweet? Now erase few of these webs, and we are officially done here. Now we need some color grading on Lightroom and see how it looks. And here is the final image. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and share the video with your friends. I'll see you in another video. Bye.